Hello, this is Brenda Gagne. As most of you know, I was in Las Vegas last weekend for the No Excuses Summit with all the internet marketers. And I wanted to shoot this real short video today just to talk about something that was kind of an overall theme throughout the weekend. And I've finally gotten back and dealt with my kids and they're finally back in their camp today. So I have a couple hours to be able to shoot a video. And I was looking through some of my notes and the one thing that just really caught my eye and just really made sense to me that in the last month has been making a lot more sense to me actually was something that uh, Jarek Robbins had talked about and he was he was probably well, pretty much the only one there that wasn't an actual internet marketer and talked about more of your personal development and your beliefs and of all the things that I talked about this is something that I just keep hearing more and more about lately which made me realize that it's probably not me hearing more about it it's just me ready to accept it actually and I wrote this down and I wanted just to read this from my notes here. So the only reason you don't have all the success you want is because you don't think that you can achieve it. It's kind of some, uh, it's very true actually. And most of you on a, you know, conscious level are like, of course I want it. Of course I'm going to do everything I can. Why am I working my butt off getting all this stuff done if I don't really want it? But if you really go way down the rabbit hole and you really think inside, you're probably having some self-sabotaging beliefs. It's very, very common. And if you learn personal development and if you listen to a lot of trainings, you'll kind of find out that that's actually something that's very, very prevalent. Um, the only reason you don't have what you want is because you have something inside you blocking that from happening. And so you really need to think, and I mean like really think, like stop what you're doing, go in a dark room and, and really think, do you have the beliefs that you're actually going to do it? Or are you still having the beliefs that... I really hope this works for me. I mean, I'm trying really hard, and I really hope this works, because that's not going to cut it. There's no try. You really have to do. You have to be committed to you're going to do this no matter what, and if you're committed to that no matter what, you're going to make this happen, well, then it's going to happen. And if no matter what you're going to make this work, then you're not going to have any self-sabotaging beliefs. So really take a look inside and say, you know, if you've got any self-doubt, that self-doubt, even if it's this much, is enough to let you not achieve what you're trying to achieve. So make sure that your self-talk is positive. Make sure that what you're saying to yourself is the absolute truth because your subconscious, it's there 24 hours a day. And if there's any part of your subconscious that is telling you that you're not quite sure this is going to work or that you're hoping this is going to work or there's no way you can really make $10,000 in an hour, it's possible. It's possible for you. You just have to make sure that you're not blocking yourself from being able to do it. So I just wanted to leave you with that today. It's kind of a quick, uh, you know, personal development, a little bit motivating motivation for uh, Monday morning. But also because, you know, we're kind of in the middle of July right now. We've got the rest of the year, and this is 2010. Are you where you wanted to be January of 2010? Is your business where it where you wanted it to be. We're halfway through, and if you're not quite there, make the mental shift that you're going to need to make. And it's not just saying it like one time, I'm, I'm going to do it. It's every single day telling yourself that you're going to do it. Every single day having it written on the wall. Every single day telling yourself positive thoughts. Then the rest of this 2010 can definitely be yours to take by storm. All right, guys, this is Brenda Gagne. Have a great day. Bye-bye.